Y'all, Whoopi's so shady. She didn't even have to say Megan McCain's name without saying it. I think, obviously, she was talking about Megan McCain. And obviously, she was talking about Abby Huntsman. Because Abby Huntsman recently released her podcast. And I covered it on my live stream. And Whoopi was supposedly her mentor. So, um, But I think more to it was about uh, Megan McCain. And then they're going to transition to Don Lemon. Girl, I'm waiting for that case. I am waiting for that case. It's this month and my birthday is next next weekend. So that's going to be... I have no right to say that will be my birthday present to find out if Don Lemon is guilty. <laughs> but it's innocent to proven guilty. But like I said, Dustin Heiss, the man who's accusing Don Lemon, has a strong witness. Strong witness. All right. And he spoke to Fox News. The bar manager is his witness and he saw it. He laughed at him at first, but then he was like, wait, this is actually serious. But... All right, so let's let's get on with the video. Hi, welcome to JL Wave. New to my channel, please click that subscribe and click that bell button so you'll be the first to know when I upload. Please share this video with your friends, your family, your social media pages. I know I keep telling y'all that, but it really does help my channel. I am blessed to say that my video with the Sherry Shepard and the Sonny Halston, while they was talking about Joe Rogan, that video has has gone viral and. People are agreeing with me in that, and I'm, I'm, I'm surprised that people are actually seeing. Sometimes the view can go on full-on opinion, propaganda, and people actually are seeing that in that video. Um, and with Sonny Hawson, so if, if you haven't checked that video out, go check it out. Um, and thank you so much for the views. I mean, I was like, wow, 50,000 views. That's that's pretty good, you know. Since Megan McCain, I haven't really gotten them views, you know, but I'm getting I'm getting I'm getting all right? So share this video with your friends and family. Watch this clip, and I'll come back with some more. You know what? I just have to say this. Yeah. It is really nice coming into work with y'all. Oh. Thank you. Oh, it is. I just I realized it as I was standing and watching there, looking at everybody, that it's like, um, I don't know, based on what people read. Oh, it's, please. <laughs> it's, it's very different here. It's very different it here because it's just... You know, it's good. I just wanted it to say, good, yes. I wanted to say it out loud so people heard it. Yeah. You know. It's nice. Yeah. But anywho. So it obviously was about Meghan McCain. I mean, Abby was only there for what, a year, you know, which is a uh, uh, significant time. You know, it's not that long, but it's, it's, it's a good amount. It's obviously about Meghan McCain. Um, you know, Whoopi, you said enough, though. You talked to Too Fab when the Too Fab gossip site was out and asked you on camera what you thought about it. But, I mean, hey, you're, you have your right to your own opinion. Um, it's obviously about Meghan McCain. Uh, the girl is definitely playing the victim. I'm not denying the toxic environment at the show. I mean, I, I believe every job, well, most jobs have their uh, toxic situations. Um, it's how you handle it, though. Um, and, you know, I, I think Megan McCain was a huge part of those situations where she ignited it even more. Cause I do recall, like I said previously on the show where she talked about how she calls the host to even argue about, uh, the debates that they discussed on air. She does that a lot. And she's very sensitive for someone that says that she's not a snowflake, like for Joy Behar t f to make you leave the show. Cause she says she not she did not miss you for you to get mad because you trended on Twitter a few times with, with, with Whoopi. Like, those were the reasons why she left the show. Come on now. Like, that's the definition of a snowflake. That really is. I wouldn't leave a damn show because of my employees. I, I would not. I mean, but hey, like, different strokes for different folks. She was making a million dollar plus a year. And, um, you know, if your past employer, the Daily Beast, whose media reporter told me, go get effed, y'all check my Twitter page, because I said, I told that man his wife. I told that man his wife looked like his mom. Like, and he said, "Go get effed." And then he blocked me. Justin Barragona. He he like he's a media reporter for the Daily Beast, which is uh, where Megan McCain used to work for. So if the Daily Beast don't like you and they talk badly about you, um, the View, your father has said some situations. Your mother has said some some situations. I'm pretty sure the problem is you. Right. It's it's definitely you. I, I, I'm pretty sure. Now, I'm not denying the toxic environment. There's obviously some problems and still problems that they're at the show. I'm not denying it at all. And I believe it 100 percent. But Megan McCain, girl, like use the problem, girl. You is the problem. Anyways, let me know. Stay in the comments below. 
Please do subscribe and click the bell so you'll be the first to know when I upload. Subscribe and click the bell. Check out my second channel, JOA TV. It's a personal channel. Subscribe there as well. I'm almost at 300 subscribers. Let's get there, please. Deuces. Yay! Yay!